Hi everyone, it's time for science and art. We're going to learn about the sun and make some suns ourselves. First, let's learn a little of the science of the sun. The sun, first of all, never look at the sun. It could really hurt your eyes. But scientists have special ways of looking at the sun and photographing the sun. And so that's how we know more about it. Let's take a look at what they saw. There's a picture of the sun. And look, it's got things coming off it. Here's a bigger picture. Whoa, these are called solar prominences and they're big explosions, bursts of flame curling around. From a distance, it looks a little more like that. It is burning constantly. There's another photograph. Isn't that amazing? And what's burning? Hydrogen and helium, two gases. Hydrogen and helium. The sun is a star, but it's a very close star, the closest star to us. And that's how it's able to help us with its light and warmth. Here is another picture that an artist made and they made these great solar prominences that explode. Isn't that fun? And then these little dots on top are pictures of other stars that are out there in the universe. Now, let's make some suns. Here's one I made out of a paper plate. And this is a peekaboo one. glasses on. I thought that was a good joke, right? Would a son have to wear sunglasses? No. That's funny. Now, do you notice I made the rays or the solar prominences? They could be either one. Rays are the light that come off the sun and prominences we saw in the picture before. But it does need to be colored right. It doesn't look the right color. So, I've got some paint. I'm doing it around the edge. And now, this brush had a tiny bit of pink on it, which mixed with our yellow to make it a little more like those solar prominences. Now I'll take a fresh brush and some fresh yellow And if you look closely, I've got some gold too, because isn't it fun to make things super shiny? I'm mixing them and painting it all over. Do you notice how the black, which was a permanent marker, just stays there. You can paint right over it. Isn't that fun? So you could draw your face on your paper plate first and then paint right over it without even worrying that your drawing will go away. It will stay. There we go. You like it? So that's one sun. Now, Earlier, I made a different kind of Mr. Sun with some pink 
and some orange and some yellow. And I didn't really plan it, but a face came out of it. I'm gonna put a little black on so you can see the face better. But if you're wondering how I did it, I squeezed paint on and then I folded it. Patted it. Opened it up. And that's how it became symmetrical. One side like the other. Now, when I look at it, I see some eyes here. I see a nose there. I see a mouth here, but let me just use a little black to make those things a little clearer. There are the eyes, that's one eye. What would happen if I just printed it? Shall I try? Wow, <laughs> wasn't that good? And now the nose. I'll print it. And I can always just adjust it a bit. And there's the mouth. Print it. Adjust it. And look, it's a fabulous Mr. Sun. Wow. That was fun to do too. Now, some of you like to make suns with markers. So why don't we do that? The favorite sun I've seen children do is to make a circle. With lines coming out. Nice, right? And since we're doing Mr. Sun, I can give it a face. Little dots for eyes. Some people just like to make a little line. And there's another Mr. Sun you could do. Wasn't that fun? Finally, I thought you would like to see one more sun. I have some colored paper for this one. Here it goes. Got my scissors. I'm going to cut some rays. They are joined. All set. Now we just need a circle. I'll fold this in half. Cut a circle. Or at least something roundish. I'm not sure it'll be exactly a circle, and it really doesn't matter. Good. Now 
we go. Now, time to tape some on. Do you see how I do that? With the points sticking out. It's almost done. Now it would be nice this way, or it would be nice that way, right? It just needs a face. There we go. An eye, a nose. And a mouth. Should we put some eyelashes on? Some people love to make eyelashes. Here we go. Such a nice sun. everybody here we are again one last peekaboo where am I there I am I hope you enjoyed science art about the Sun today bye-bye for now <laughs>